So what <clears throat> will King Lake whiskey taste like? We really want it to be distinguishable in a blind lineup. So there were two factors we thought were really important to achieve this, and that was a consistent product or consistent taste, as well as a unique taste. Just like when I go to the shop and I buy one of my favorite Scottish whiskies, Lafrog, I buy it because I pretty much know what it's going to taste like. So we've used the same recipe, the same types of grain. We try and get the same type of barrels. We'll be vatting, so we'll grab a whole lot of barrels and put them together to really try and get that consistent taste. So we won't have any single cast releases on our main line, but really anyone can do this. What makes King Lake Whiskey unique is what makes any world-class single malt different, and that is where it's made. Just like Talister and Springbank have that marine time taste due to being located on the shores. We encourage our whiskey to take on the taste of King Lake. So how is this done? Well, water is hugely important in the production of whiskey. Water has its own, all types of water have its own types of minerals and therefore its own type of taste. So we've got a natural spring on our property. So that will be going up into our whiskey untouched, unfiltered. We always have our doors open. We have an open live fermentation, so our tanks can take in all the different sort of live yeast that's floating around in the air. And where are we located? We're located in, surrounded by bushland and farming. We've got sort of big, tall mountain ash trees that some that still are 75 metres tall that survived the lumberjacks many years ago. We've got some blue eucalyptus that's used for essential oils. And in seasons, this really creates a spicy, sweet smell in the air. But also is what making Lake famous, and that's due to growing produce. It has a real rich, rich earth and a real smell. I remember when my uncle grew potatoes and all the family came up to help um, sort of at the different parts of it, either picking it or planting it, and they're cutting the earth up. You can just, it's just like King Lake just smelts with like this real rich, earth is yeah it's lovely but hopefully all those things will have its impact and give king lake its unique taste or its whiskey its unique taste which hopefully we should be able to all sample by the end of 2020 until then